Me. I can't wait. <laughs> I might not do the two shows on Friday so I can see Battlefield Los Angeles, motherfucker. Yeah, Is that coming out Friday? That Friday. One. Fuck, I do want to see that. So yeah. I think I'm going to be at Caroline's Thursday. Saturday, Sunday. <laughs> I'm bullshitting you, literal or, motherfuckers. Or that'll just be another disappointing thing, I think, though. You think? Like, it looks cool. Can one of these movies be fucking... I wish. What it's supposed to be. Independence Day, the first half. Yeah. I think... It still gives me the, the excitement good. chills. The big fucking ships, up, and we're fucked. And, oh, up yeah. to the Statue of Liberty raped. <laughs> That's the, it's up to the up to the when it's clo after the destruction and the fucking bottoms closing back up. Yeah. Then after Bill Pullman takes over, then it it's becomes just the worst it. movie. You'd all be dead if it wasn't for my son David. <laughs> <laughs> here's, here's the part I can't get past. Is a Will Smith part. Oh, this oh. alien. Who yeah. who single handedly was destroying Area Fifty One with his mind yeah. and his and his <laughs> and his and his giant suit his his suit that encases him and makes him impenetrable. Yeah, Will F Smith punched him in the face, punched him, and that said, took "Welcome," out, and huh? knocked him out. And then and then it killed doctors. Yeah, choked the guy, made him talk through his mind. Mm -hmm. Ki almost killed the president with his mind. Right. And Will Smith knocked, didn't knock the alien out, knocked out his outfit. <laughs> to where he f he thought. He knocked out his this outfit. This is where he assumed the alien's chin would be that he could knock this guy. Because we have the same, those aliens have the same nerves where if you get hit in the temple, <laughs> it, it, it came out with fearsome evil. And then it just, and then he dragged it through the. S this knocked out alien in a suit. <laughs> you hated that I'm taking it. Please tell me you hated that. Yeah. <laughs> I, that I could not get past yeah. some of the things that bothered me about that movie. Yeah, but agree. the first the fir when the when it comes over the moon with the fucking Very cool. This 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 race of aliens who fucking travel through the solar system. And the size of those things. and the 15 miles. It was... I, I loved it. Here's he's the point. Knocking, I hate the suit saucy out. lines like uh, this. But, Patrice, in all fairness, when I saw this in the theater, <laughs> this was this was a clap break. The thing is, it was those dummies. I, I hate clap breaks in movies where everyone feels like, oh, yeah. yes, he goes, welcome to Earth. That's he why he I'm not a movie maker. Suit. So maybe you needed that, but mm. I fucking... But, that's when I started to hate the movie, because I loved what you loved. The fucking graphics, the idea of it, and, yeah, and they yeah. cornballed it up. And they he, you don't need it, to yeah. do that. And Randy Quaid should never be allowed to oh, make a movie again. God. No! He stinks in everything. Look, man, it was so Bill bad. Pullman. Bill too. Pullman. His decision on how to act in that movie... That destroyed. <laughs> yes. he, he says something. We will not go quietly into the night. His big speech at the. Uh, uh, before Did he the do battle. Clint Eastwood? He sounded like the fucking. Yes! The, out, the outlaw Bill Z. Wales. <laughs> I fucking hated him. He goes, the kid goes, Daddy, let me stay up all night. You let her stay up all night? Traitor. Yeah. He he. Well, I see. It's been coming on cable. I there's some movies you know you got to watch. I, I've seen it a thousand Independence times. Independence Day okay. comes yeah. on. Yes. It. it the I don't know why. The beginning when the moon is shaking and this fucking race of creatures is coming to kill us all. When the this ship still finally gets me. Breaks through the cloud with the fire because oh. it's like for a while you're like it's just smoky cloudy. And the shit. music. Dun, yeah. dun, 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 dun. Everybody stops in New York. It was so. How it would be, but you yep. know, was, you know who sucked in the beginning though. The oh my God, I got to call my psychiatrist. <laughs> it's like forget, Harvey oh, forget. But he didn't I'm fuck it my, up. My lawyer, I'll oh, forget my lawyer. Get it? Because we hate our that's lawyers. How a, that's how a flamboyant old gay guy would act <laughs> if the aliens were attacking. <laughs> I didn't even. <laughs> you didn't mind that as much. I didn't mind. I love Judd. What's his name? No, you taxi. Didn't. No, no. You didn't. <laughs> Judd Hirsch. That's what the. Fuck uh, Judd Hirsch. Who he be Kikeberger? <laughs> <laughs> that was the worst parody of a Jewish guy. <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy, that was horrible. Be careful. You're trying to get on Two and a Half Men. Remember, yeah. Jews couldn't have liked that. That no. picture, picture, uh, of, picture of his name was yeah. Rufus Johnson. Yeah. Rufus Johnson. Yeah. He was going. You knew then. You knew then. 
Yeah. If, if his name was Rufus Johnson, he was going, why didn't y'all hand me some chicken for the aliens? <laughs> it was that bad, huh? Y'all should have handed me some chicken for the aliens. I Jews were embarrassed by that role. They had to be. But he was Jewy. I've, I've, no, I've seen Jews like that. That's my David. That's my David. My we David. get it. Show us your cock. Show us its cunt. We got gotcha. you. Jew. Got it. You didn't need it. He could have downplayed oh. that and just bit him. It was, it was so over the top, it was distracting. You, oh. you walked right into that, Patrice. Oh. But it drove me nuts. Right into that. I love Jared Hirsch in Taxi. He be he be, he he be Kikeberger. He be he it was a caricature of a Jewish guy. You love David for my David. Except, you don't have to do that. Just and the, and the generals are like listening to him on the plane. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, listen and to the old the, Jewish guy. Area 51. Area 51. But he didn't. I'm telling. We've Bill been making Pullman fun of that for years. Me, man. Oh, years. Bill Pullman was terrible. I, I, the movie to me, other than Bill Pullman's decisions, yeah, it, it's it's I, I the first I still get excited at the build up to the fact that these aliens are going to. Yeah, us that up. was great. I'm a pilot. I belong up there. Oh, wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a <laughs> fucking minute. Yes. Here's another thing Will Smith did. He goes, they go, what are we going to do, man? He goes, sir, this is when they decide to attack the ship. I'm well aware of their maneuvering capabilities. I'm going, nigga, I, I'm well aware of trains and how they fucking move. <laughs> did you just say I'll fly the ship to the fucking, to the mothership? This is lazy writing. I'll Based fly. on what? Or nothing. <laughs> he said, I'm well aware of their maneuvering. Ca I know how DC 10s sure. maneuver. <laughs> I've seen them in the sky. You're fucking going to fly a spaceship to the giant mothership <laughs> based on you seen them. Seen. I, that, it, there's a couple. I'm telling you, the alien, the, <laughs> the fucking alien who destroyed the doctors. <laughs> yeah. Who had three other ones in water? <laughs> water in his in his outfit. Yeah, in his outfit. He's in his outfit, it, and he punches him in the face. It was awful. But you love the movie. Love the first half. Dude, dude, you don't understand. Wasn't there some nice catchphrases in that movie? Too? Not even one catchphrase that, that stands. If I spent this area 51, <laughs> they could have bargained down to area 50. If I spent this, he's my David. If I knew I was meeting the president, maybe I would have dressed. Yes, I would have, I would have eaten cool. I wouldn't let, have dressed let, like a shrub <laughs> meal. Oh, I'm not going to let it. I'm not going to let Norton make me feel like. Face off. You hate Judd Hurst. <laughs> I could have been eating Kugo. Uh, Why would I do this? You yes, know what? This, one, this is very nice. This is very. This is social. Could you find some, please, Danny? Yeah. Because is, is there any there? I, to me, and I guess you know what makes me understand what he's doing now makes me see something. <laughs> When I see a black person, they got him acting fucked up. <laughs> yeah. Maybe other people just don't see where that's bad. Yeah, where it's he right, wasn't right. he be he jubed at me. <laughs> he that's what they he are be to me. He didn't bother. That's <laughs> stereo. That would have been like if they had a gay guy. <laughs> if they had a gay guy. If, if Harvey Firestein's character, which was way over the top, had said. Well, I have to get out of here. Let me shove everything in my asshole and run out backwards with my small dog. Let me run out with my sick friend and my small dog and my things in my asshole coming. I'm gay. Get it? Got it. Got this it. Is not, this is not checkmate. This is not checkmate. Yes. But that didn't bother you. No, no, it didn't. That did. didn't bother you. You said, was my so, David. But was, that didn't bother you. It no, did, no, Anthony. No, no, no. The, not the first time I saw it. Oh, Everything he says bothers me Judd now Hirsch because I know where it's going. Judd Hurst. Yeah. He God, yeah. didn't bother you. But he did. Yes, he did. Uh, like, like now when I watch the movie, I think of that later on, Judd Hirsch, and it translates into the beginning. So now, right from the beginning, I hate here's it. Some, here's something black that, that might have bothered black people, but white people wouldn't even know. Why is she a stripper? Oh, shit. Why, why is Vivica be a stripper? Fox a fucking... Was that his wife? She could have been yeah. a nurse. Right, That's yeah. how unimportant being a stripper... If if something in the, in the movie happened where the aliens seen her titties and didn't attack, you right. can go, okay. It's like, wait, right. let me the show my tits. The reason was because... No, no, you see... Uh, 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 her boyfriend. Uh, 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 I know what you're gonna say, but it had nothing to, to do be, with yeah. it. It had nothing wanted, to wanted do. Wanted to be an right. astronaut. They could have just said no because he's a nigger. They didn't have to <laughs> add that she was a. <laughs> nah, we ain't let no niggas in space. <laughs> <laughs>
I was thinking maybe it was because they have that touching scene uh, with the president's wife when the president's wife is dying. They wanted to show like how even a sh like they could connect oh, on that kind of a yeah, level. Like, oh, like, you could have did that if she was just you know a right? oh, no, he's by right herself. Yeah, but I'm saying that's he's the cheesiness right, of the movie. Like that's he's where right they down. were going. Oh, with. you're a dancer. Oh, ballet. She goes, no, right, right, right. It, it, was, it was no. just for that yes, scene. I yeah. show my cunt for money, first lady, <laughs> who I'd never be really next to in real life. <laughs> and that's another thing. She's got internal injuries. And they just let her die there. They weren't even trying to Dude, help her. Dude, the, the first lady died. The first lady, and she's in fine. the alien hospital. She's got color to her. She's moving around, and they're like, ah, there's nothing we can do. Internal it's like, bleeding? Well, could you try something? She died of internal bleeding. They didn't even try. I was so happy when she died. I didn't yeah. feel sad. I was hoping it was contagious, and everyone would get it, except for the aliens. Bill Pullman walks oh. out of the place, and he's just like, is mommy sleeping? Yeah. Yeah, uh, she's sleeping. Uh, and then he looked at the kid. He, down. he looked at the kid. He goes, "Your mouthwash ain't making it. And, <laughs> go ahead, make my day. I'm going to do all of his lines." Bill Pullman. <laughs> the second half of, of I I turn off. Uh, it's just like Pulp Fiction. Anything that Sam Jackson is not in, not interested. Yeah. And I, I'm I'm just serious. I I I can't watch. You need it Sam Jackson him. in. He Pulp has Fiction. to be in every scene. That's why I like. This may be sacrilegious. But this is why I like Jackie Brown better than oh. Pulp Fiction. Mm. Because Sam Jackson, it, it was, you know, fucking good Sam Jackson. Sam Jackson was a ruthless motherfucker he, in, in that Jackie Brown. The entire movie was Sam Jackson. No one fucked that movie up for me. Pulp Fiction. But, but uh, Independence Day, the first 45 minutes to an hour, when it's like, time's up. Yeah. <laughs> but there were things happening at this point, though. Yeah, yeah. That yeah. could have made them go, let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> um, up to this point, when they weren't communicating. Yeah, yeah. They were just <laughs> sitting there with giant ships, placement all over right, the fucking right. globe. Perhaps. And something else. That fucking six hour drive from fucking New York. New York to that Washington, they made in four hours during the escape of, <laughs> from aliens. Like they just it's some things they you were know, very lazy. Yep. Vivica Fox lived during a this firestorm of ten billion degrees this in a tunnel. Cleansing fire. This bitch was the only one that knew to kick that door in. And her dog lived. And what kind of asbestos room is she in? <laughs> what the fuck? Like, there were things... She lived, but then she got mesothelioma. <laughs> Dude, the beginning of that movie was spectacular, man. I, I still, to this day, it's it's my favorite first half of a fucking movie. It's a movie. great I agree first with half. Patrice on yeah, that. Yeah. that about, yeah. can we, can we hear a little bit of Judd Hirsch if you can find What about uh, Full Metal oh, Jacket? As, as, ah. as far as... Fir, uh, That's favorite, another first half. Yeah, good. favorite yeah. first half Why of the movie. Why not you stomping private piles, Godzilla? <laughs> <laughs> what, should private pile be in the barracks at this hour? <laughs> I, don't, I think the second half, I thought first, Anim, Animal Mother oh, is one of my favorite characters. That is good. Adam Baldwin in that. I love Adam Baldwin. Underrated guy. He's great in My Bodyguard. And he stands over this dead guy who died, like, jerking off or something. And everybody's like, we're going to miss him. Oh, I love you. And he goes, better you than me. He was in Independence Day, too. Yeah, Adam Bolt, but that's the... Yeah, yeah. I don't know what... He's, he's one of those guys, then. Mm. I love Adam Baldwin, man. Oh, Let's, please. A little yeah. bit of this. Oh, oh, this is... Is this... Is this... Is this uh, <laughs> oh, Joey Kikeberger, yes. Is it, is it, no, Hebe Kikeberger. Hebe Kikeberger. Hebe Kikeberger. Fucking stuff. And it did bother me, because... Oh, I don't see Jews like this, and that to me was so funny. It was such a clowning I of Jews. I thought this was Jews. No. This didn't bother me. <laughs> uh, Listen to me. Come on. Just like you say the fucking Tyrone character. Right. Like, motherfucker go, hey, man, chicken. I might go, why is he talking like this? But to like a white person that doesn't know, it's right. like, what's your problem? If he was Italian, he would go, hey, you don't get aliens some beats. I got to go. Hey, you know, I get Jersey Shore, man. Put the big hubcaps on the spaceship. They ride around. That's my mother's sauce. <laughs> oh, Vito. Ain't that them? Yeah. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> That's th Those are the women. <laughs> All right. Also making the list, Stripes. First half of Stripes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, then, and then it, it got really just good. Stupid. I just watched oh, it and then, then fell it got apart. weird and serious, yeah, right? There's a bunch yeah. of those movies where the first half was great. But we got you the audio of uh, it, oh, Stripes go, go, go. When, fucking, when they all get in trouble for mud wrestling. And I just saw the scene again. And and uh, and John Larroquette wants an explanation, and John Candy's like, "Well, sir, we got on our way to Bengal Parlor, and directions get all fouled up." And he goes, "Shut up, <laughs> okay, sir, okay, sir, okay, sir, that okay. big fat head, okay, <laughs> sir, okay, sir." 
<laughs> oh, it's Greg. It's so Shut cool. up. So this is Hebe Kuiper. Yeah, here. Yes, Hebe Kuiper. Yeah, let's hear him. You're going to kill them and us at the same time. If we fire nukes, sure. then everybody else who's got it's going to fire. Got it. You know what that means? Fallout. You're in your nuclear winter. It's the end of life. Hold on. Pause right there. He already actually skated in on penny shoes. He already looks. I wear penny shoes, not penny loafers. He already looks really Jewish. Of course he does. He's thinking, what can I say that sounds Jewish? He hasn't even talked yet. And you can tell he's he's very Jewish. Yes, he's actually reading a book. T for T for I'm Torah. Not gonna let him, yeah, yeah. I'm not going to let him make me fucking hate John Hirsch in the Independence Day. Before you, before you get to Kaigi Heeberger, he, 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 uh, there, there's also who, what's that other actor uh, that was in there? Jeff Goldblum. The, no, no, Robert Loggia. Yeah, Loger. Robert Loggia. That one thing where he goes, "Get on the horn, let's tell them how to bring them sons of bitches down." <laughs> <laughs> it's so over dramatic. Uh, tell them uh, how to bring those sons of bitches. I think I know down. every line in that fucking oh, movie I, I, and know which ones I hate a thousand times and sometimes uh, I got to turn away from the TV cuz I'm too embarrassed to look at it. Uh, let, let's see what let's, let's see, see what oh, fucking he be Here he he, come. He, he looks guy. Jewish already. It's, he walked in looking ethnic. Oh. It can't be allowed. Shut up. Just get him out of here. Hey, don't tell him to shut up. <laughs> <laughs> No one is this Jewish. You'll all be dead now if it wasn't my David. None of you did anything to prevent this. <laughs> 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 Wait a minute, time out. Where's his penis? <laughs> can someone Jewish please tell me if this is wrong? It's so wrong. Is this wrong. a wrong Jew? There are Jewish no... guys like that, but it was such an obvious uh, stereotype. So he top. should be walking oh. through the desert with a fuckload of Jews behind oh. him. He could have just walked in and said, hey, don't talk to him that so way. What, be was, dead the, without what him. was the most ah. Jewy thing he did? That mo every I, every oh word. God. Every syllable. Oh he, every syllable. It's the cadence. Ah, uh, you can't fuck this Dude, up. If he you can't fuck up. If he uh, wore a shirt with let's... Israel on it, it couldn't have been as over the top Jewish. How about vultures? <laughs> He's, uh, let's, let's, listen listen to, the uh, let's listen to the whole Vulture. scene. Uh, <laughs> try to get through the whole scene. Okay, that's quick. Now, it wasn't my David. None of you did anything to prevent this. There's nothing we could do. We were totally unprepared for this. Ah, don't give me unprepared. Come on, children. It was what, in the 19, what, 50s or whatever, you, you had that uh, spaceship. Pause. <laughs> <laughs> Why are the generals entertaining this old Why Jewish guy? Why are they guy? listening to him with his stupid well, beard? there's nothing oh. we could do. Why does he have to justify they, himself right, They should have said, go take your orders from fucking Louis de Palma, stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Beat it. Beat it. Get Jim Norton in here. He could have done a better job. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking so annoying. Not the when, when was the, the, the 50s? The 50s? 51. Watch, watch Robert Loge's face <laughs> when he says Area 51. Yeah. 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 Back, please. Oh, that thing that you found in the thing. Please rewind that. I have to hear that. I have to hear that fucking. That thing that. that you, hey, my wife, that thing that you found in the desert. Let's hear it. Oh. Don't give me unprepared. Come on, children. It was what, in the 19, what, 50s or whatever? You, you had that uh, spaceship. Dad. Oh, Dad. Yeah, that yeah, thing that you found in New Mexico. <laughs> Dad. What was that? No, no, not the spaceship. Was that Roswell? Roswell, New Mexico, yeah. No, you had the spaceship and you had the bodies. They were all locked up in a, in a bunker. <laughs> what was that? David. I don't know. Area 51, right? Area 51. You knew then. And you did nothing. Oh. Why did somebody put that up as a as a great clip? There's I, I, someone that <laughs> loved that enough or hated to put it, it enough. Up. They love. I'll tell you the best part of that clip at the end when the guy oh, silently. Oh, is hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the best part of that clip. The end of it when the guy silently stands up from the couch. <laughs> Rewind right there. I'll show you the best part of the clip. Watch, Danny. Just go back a little bit. Watch. Here we go. The best part of this clip. Right there. <laughs> Bill, Pullman. Bill Pullman almost stands up. Standing up, he's like, uh. Now you know that you did not say I'm so, so mad nothing. at what they did to that fucking film. I'm so I, mad. I completely agree with Patrice on that. It could have been an amazing movie. When, when the fucking, after the destruction, it was like, the when it was just quietly destroyed yeah, yeah. the earth. Yeah, yeah. And it just closed back up. And then we get to that scene. How does it <clears throat> yeah. go from that to You know what they should have did? And Judd Hurst should have come into that room with a fucking yellow star of David on his striped shirt. <laughs> this is this is why I'm excited about <laughs> Battlefield Los Angeles. I'm, yeah. This is what the hope is. This is where this began. <clears throat> oh, yeah. This is what the hope is. 
is that it will be what the end of Independence Day should have been, where uh-huh. they was preparing for the 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 invasion. The invasion, right? right. And and it th- this is what I'm. This is almost to me like I'm hoping it's Independence Day two, where right. they actually get on invade. Earth and invade. Right. And do you think Meyer <clears throat> Sheckelford will save the day? <laughs> oh. <laughs> They're invading. Yes, they're you running. You knew Dan, and you did not. No, no, Dan. What was that place down the street from the kosher deli? That you're not sure if I'm Jewish? I'll say it again. Why, not? Why do we sick the monster after him? You know the Loch Ness monster. I don't you know. know. Dan. There's a monster in the Loch Ness. What is that place? I said it once, but I'll say it with a heavier accent. Oh yeah, you see, Dan. What was it that place? Oh yeah, we got. Got it. <laughs> we understand you are by mitzvah. It's okay. Patrice has officially been knocked out. He's, he's down and out. <laughs> You're out. That's one of the You're things out. I hate it. Did he have one of y'all? Yeah. No. Oh, no, he says. put one on, though. He didn't because he didn't feel it was Jewish enough. <laughs> Jesus Christ. He put a yarmulke on when they was in prison. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, he goes, but I'm not Jewish. Some guy goes, I'm not Jewish. Nah. <laughs> That nobody's perfect. Is there any? Please, we have one more clip of that fucking. But I, I hated him in that. I hated fucking the the uh, the president. I hated the. Fu- I hated everyone, even Will Smith, who I think is a really good actor. But doing that fucking that stupid wacky line. You don't need them. You don't the need cop and buddy movie and lines. And jiving while he's uh, stop it. Flying the fighter plane. Oh no, you don't. What are you doing? Real he fighter did, pilots you know don't what? talk that he way. Did, in terms of douche chills. Yeah. Oh no, you didn't shoot that green shit at me. Right. It why you can be humorous, right? Again, I'm just saying from a yeah. fan of movies. Yeah, yeah. Why didn't why wasn't it real? It they I know. why did they have to Cuz they suck. You did not shoot, shoot that green shit at me. First of all, they attacked the ship. Yeah. That the it swallowed up the, the missiles. The, yeah. It didn't even explode. They went boink, 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 boink. Yeah. <laughs> and people were dying. And they would pull up and his boy died. Yeah. And and no, you didn't shoot that green shit at me. Gives me the, the it, fucking it's creeps. Horrible. Especially the scene that they cut out, which was when Judd Hirsch saw that. He goes, the green! Isn't that liquid money? They're shooting liquid money? My David would have drank it? Let me put this on. Can you see this? I'm praying. What? You gotta love... Wait a minute, though. All right. Can we agree... That uh, 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 what's his name? The other, his son, who plays uh, his son? David uh, Jeff Goldblum. Goldblum. Jeff Bo- Goldblum. Go- Goldblum was flawless. He, I he like did him. Nothing douche chilly. No, he's just I'll, Jeff Goldblum. Uh, he's weird and everything. But he was he was excellent. I thought yeah. anything he did where he goes where you you know so you guys can go up there and and do your thing and. And, and um, do you think it, uh, down, take it down? Take it, I thought it he out, was excellent. It, um, yeah, I, I love Jeff down. Goldblum. But to me, is there any more Judd Hirsch, Danny? I'm, I'm, oh, for Pete's sake. So Pete could we vote on somebody it. to get out of Independence Day? And, and, yes, and, whoever wrote it. Yeah. Yeah, the, the writing fell apart. Like, you've, uh, you've made your point. I would say point. the president was horrible. Bill Pullman stunk. I thought Will Smith stunk. And it's because, like, when he, in, in Men in Black 2 or whatever, when he, when he jumped down, he goes, Rain and black folks. I'm like, <laughs> what are you doing with that shit line? <laughs> Why do you movies. make the guy who's a great actor a real fucking soldier or a real fucking guy who, like he said, there's humor in it, but it doesn't have to be shuck and jive humor. It doesn't have to be the over-the-top Jewish I, I, guy to make Jewish people I've, seem compassionate. Stupid. You know what was funny in the movie, and the funny was perfect, was the Say guy- Randy Quaid, and I'll no. break my computer <laughs> over your teeth. <laughs> no. <laughs> he didn't bother me, by the way. The uh, kids bother me more He didn't either. bother you? But wait a minute. Do we have a clip? The oh. guy who played the robot in, in Star Trek. Uh, next generation data D- data the guy who played the oh the Spider. the doctor guy the doctor uh, yeah yeah is a character that's funny within his own weirdness it, yeah, it wasn't because he's been just locked <laughs> yeah away he's just a weirdo. So long, a weirdo so you laugh right. at that kind of shit but the but oh no you didn't shoot that green shit at me just it yeah. to this day I got to turn the TV now when that scene comes Every, Every, huh? and, oh that was him I didn't know that was him yeah yeah, yeah and by the way the I, I thought it was genius where they tied in Area Fifty One. And they did have a ship that they could like get some like knowledge from. Like I thought that <clears> it <throat> could have been. Like, there was the some things where they that just said great. "fuck it." Yeah, they just said "fuck it." How do we kill these aliens? We just blow their ship up with a <laughs> with a ship that they. Wait a minute. Why would they bring? Wait a fucking minute. <laughs> Why would that giant ship 
Yeah. Bringing that little one from fucking Earth when they all go on the big ones that's already down there. Why would they fly into space and they go, oh, it's a little one just chilling. Let's bring them right in and dock them right in front of me with the fucking missile. And ain't that the 1950s model? (laughs) (laughs) These motherfuckers don't even have the 2000 model fucking little ship. (laughs) Yeah, Uh, that's pretty funny. And they 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 fucking can't tell that someone... That would literally be like a a turtle driving an Edsel into your garage. (laughs) How would you not know? (laughs) Maybe he won't. Notice. Yeah, all right. Let's go outside. The turtle with the gun wants to shoot us from the edge. It just could have been so real. I just, it just, they could have kept it so. That's really fun. So yeah. good. Yeah. Hey, uh, not the best over the top two of all time. Really? <laughs> what were they saying? Not the best. Who Patricia could've... should know this one. I don't know. You should know this one. I don't know. All right, we'll go right for the answer. But uh, a movie we saw together. Scooter in Illinois. No, but no, wait, Scooter, wait, Scooter. Before you say it, wait, <laughs> wait, Scooter. That was supposed of to... Of course, of course. That was uh, supposed to be dead serious. Of course, that's the difference. Okay, okay. We, we do know it's the, the, that's the difference. That, not on, over the top, but maybe the greatest Jew character of all time. This guy with this guy. The greatest over the top Jewish Un- character of all time. Dude, Done dude. on purpose. That's, that's the difference, Scooter. But go ahead. Hey, boys, how y'all doing today? Good. Uh, I think the best Jewish character played was Tom Cruise in Tropic Thunder. We howled. Oh. Remember how laughed we, we, <coughs> we laughed? But it was remember suppo- how hard we laughed. Less, that that was less gross to be. was hilarious. That was supposed no, I know, that's to what be. We just said. Yeah. We said that. And it was that's so the racist. It w- I don't oh, even yeah, think yeah. this one is trying to be racist. No, he's no. Just I think he's trying to, to be an authentic an Jew authentic guy. Oh my Jew God, guy. yeah, he's not trying to be. He's just not an the old character. Guy. Les Grossman was maybe the most racist character I fucking. It was so racist, I was getting nervous. Yeah, like oh like, boy, yeah, someone's Tom gonna Cruise lose his mind. Yeah, I was like, I was getting to, nervous to agree to this. Oh, also another movie that uh, had a great first half, Blazing Saddles. Makes you the know list. What? Yeah. Fuck. When that fucking movie ends up in the in the in the uh, catering hall or whatever the fuck, they, it's uh, like kinda, a Warner that's Brothers Mel Brooks, back though. Mel Brooks kind of gets weird. Spaceballs nah, yeah, was like that too. Just like falls apart. They didn't know like, how to what end. What happened? That, they didn't know how to end that fucking movie. They, they didn't young, know how to end it. Frankenstein was like weird. <laughs> they should have called David. David would have ended it properly <laughs> for them. They should have done. You know what I mean? David. <laughs> <laughs> I I like Joe. No, you I don't. refuse. I refuse. You're not so gonna get me. Watch him again, and everything he says, you're gonna go. Ugh. So this is just based on the fact the new movie's coming out Friday. Battle Skyline, Battle Los Angeles. Skyline man. had a great trailer and it was it, it was horrific. Yeah, that was a bomb. If I see, if I, I never see, even saw it. If but. I see that fucking uh, Brett Ratner again, I'll punch him in his stomach. <laughs> he knew. You could see it in his eyes. He was like. Ugh. Maybe we'll get I'm going to get him. Maybe we'll get a nice opening. What's we'll fucking put him in choke We didn't know. The, we, we just talked about the trailer with that guy going, wow, the fucking trailer oh, looks what, amazing. What movie is that? Oh, Skyline? Skyline. Were you here for that? No. No, no for Brett, I was away. Yeah, Brett, he, he's a great guy. He's a cool guy. He had a lot of good stories. Yeah, but, I like Brett Ratner, but, but he was pretty much fuck. He was pretty much telling us the movie sucked. No, I don't think he was. Yeah, he he pretty was pushing much was. it. Was he? Yeah, he was, t- he was talking about special effects a little too much. He was, really, he was saying how cheap they are to make and, yeah, and yeah. the kind of return that you get but on such a cheap But those guys are doing Battlefield Los Angeles. And I, but I thought the effects was great, though. And that movie. And Skyline. Skyline. Yeah. But the movie was just hey, bad. Also, Patrice uh, playing Caroline's Thursday through Sunday, 212-757-4100. These tickets are going to go fast. But uh, you want to talk NBA for a second. Oh, that- Miami Heat. Yeah, there's a big turnoff for some of these people, but other people like to hear, hear basketball talk. Yeah, the show. I guess some Twitter is that I have to block when they for when I'm doing sports. I have to get rid of them. <laughs> I don't you like don't fucking it. make decisions on what I like, motherfucker. You'll-